Well, hello everybody. Uh, this is Bob Courtney, and this is my Unit 4 Discussion Board video. Um, looking at the details for this assignment, it doesn't really look to be something that's really hard to solve. And uh, by that, let me go over a little bit of it. Um, the first thing that we have that's a problem here is we've got a evaluation form for the teachers and the faculty that doesn't really go into detail. So because of that, um, I guess the faculty is just trying to do as much as they can um, to get by and just fulfill their duties. Now me, um, in this discussion board, I'm going to be the mentor and there's a mentee, which is a third grade teacher, and she just took on the role of the chairperson for the school committee. So she's a little frustrated because most of the members do not want to participate in any way. And they give her pushback when she attempts to assign tasks and schedule meetings. Now, this really isn't much different than any other um, job mentor uh, for somebody. So... Um, let me tell you what I would do on a situation like this. The first thing I would do is set a meeting up with all the faculty to let them know who I am and that I am the chairperson. And uh, what I want to do is make everybody realize we're all on the same path here. And in this situation, um, our main goal is to teach our students to give them the best education that they can. And that is not only our job, but that was something that we took on when we decided we wanted to be a teacher. And I think everybody would probably agree with that. Um, second of all, one of the things that this third grade teacher, um, or third year teacher, needs to do is get to know everybody. Um, by that, she can set up maybe just an email, group email with everybody involved and have them send her a one-page summary of how long they've been a teacher, what their main goals in life are, what her family life is like, what they do as hobbies, everything just to kind of get to know um, about themselves. And... In the same way, she should be doing the same thing and put it out to all the faculty. Um, I think this is something that should go out as a group email so everybody can read everybody else's story. And by doing that, um, everybody can kind of get to know each other. So let's say we get that out and a week from the time that that is turned in, um, it would be time to get all the faculty together for, say, maybe a half hour um, meeting um, once a week. And the first one would be to go over everybody's um, story and let them know, um, again, that we're all on the same path as to what we need to get done. And that there will be tasks for everybody to do. Now, not everybody is going to be doing 150%. It's just human nature. You're going to get some people that's going to do just enough to get by, and then you're going to do some. You're going to get some that's going to want to put the extra effort out and do 150%. So um, I would tell my mentee, don't get frustrated with that. Um, then I would also give a list of all the tasks that need to be done and kind of let everybody look at that give them say 48 hours and say respond back to me and let me know what seems um, an interesting task for you to do because um, everybody has different ideas and different things that they like to do so with that that would be a way that everybody could work together and uh, get tasks done um, then I would once that's put together 
I would tell my mentee to let them know what is expected and if they need help, please contact them um, that you'd be willing to work together with them to get it done. Um, and just take it from there. I mean, it's a group project, even though there's one person in charge of everybody. Um, the best way to get it done and is to get everybody involved and uh, make everybody feel a part of the committee. And that's the main thing here. Um, I would also schedule meetings once a week to see how things are going. Um, let them all know that you are available 24-7 if, if need be, um, by email or text or by phone. Um, and I think, um, you know, as I've always said, not everybody's a leader, not everybody can be a mentee or mentor. Um, you can teach somebody to lead a committee, but there's some people that just can do it naturally. Um, and uh, some people that really have to work at it. In this case, this third year teacher may have to work at it. Um, but it's important to let her know that not everybody's gonna like her or him, whoever it is. Um, but there's a task to be done and uh, if done right, um, everybody will at least respect you for what you're trying to get done and just teach everybody or treat everybody the way you want to be treated and the task will get done and everybody can work together. So anyway, that is my um, idea on this discussion board assignment and please feel free to get back with me. Let me know what you think and um, once again, um, it's always a learning experience for all of us so uh, I've enjoyed this week and I am looking forward to hearing your comments thank you